Well, hello, my name is Steve Samuel from Design Visionaries, and today I have a technique that I would like to show you that I think is very, very powerful, and that is the technique of controlling geometry with an external spreadsheet. So this is a little bezel that has a height, it has a length, it has a width, it has uh, dimensions that control the wall thickness and the size of the window. And I have those dimensions as variables in this external spreadsheet. So as you can see, I've got the variable names and I've got the quantities and I've got the overall description of everything that is really important about this model. So, for example, when I want to change this model, I can double click in the cell and put in another number. Let's say it's the width of the unit. So suddenly I want it to be 100. I save that number and then I simply go into NX and say Control E. Control E brings up the expressions editor where I can say update for external change. Right here I click the button and as you can see the whole unit changes according to the numbers that we've popped into the spreadsheet. So that's 100 now. As another example I'll put 20 millimeters into the overall height and I'll save that and as you can see if I go to control E or the expressions editor is already up I can then say update for external change right here and the new height comes in and now the unit is higher thicker and so that is extremely powerful the way to accomplish this task is to use a variable called ug underscore cell underscore read and the arguments for it are the location of the video and the name of the uh, I'm sorry the location of the part file the uh, external spreadsheet that is and the uh, cell number that the variable is in so if you have a lot of these values in a cell you use the UG cell read variable once then my recommendation is export that file edit it manually so that you could just copy paste copy paste copy paste and then you can very quickly bring in a lot of expressions from a single spreadsheet terrific uh, this technique and many others are outlined in a book that I wrote called Super Duper Advanced NX. It's a project-oriented manual, so if you get the manual, you will have many, many projects that has, have this technique and many others. Um, the projects are written for people who are busy. There's not a lot of fluff in the document, and it's, of course, available on www.designviz.com. It's also available on Amazon. We'd rather you buy it from us, though. <laughs> and uh, again, the title is Super Duper Advanced NX. And thank you very much for the privilege of being part of this amazing group of creative people. And uh, hopefully I will see you online. Thanks again.